here's another test recording, but this time with a little bit of the gameplay video to see how how it sounds. Oh, look at that! We're standing in the building, and it's, let's try and make it seem natural. So, um, uh, we're gonna try to make it seem natural. Try. It doesn't have to be that natural. No, it, it could be like Alpha Rad natural. <laughs> but he exactly. he doesn't try at all. Exactly. That's how he's so good. <laughs> <clears throat> By the way, uh, now that I know that, um, now that I know that you can access the DLC the moment we cast Slowpoke, we should go and do some of that. Oh, you want us to go to that island? Just to catch like one or two Pokemon, yeah. Which ones? Mm -hmm. Okay. Just it's an unlock, whatever the first one is. Oh yeah, whatever we start off with there. Yeah. That makes sense. Do you want to just make this the actual recording? Yeah, screw it. Screw cool. it. Let's do it. Alright, so give you guys things. a heads up. Uh just letting you guys know ahead of time. Um oh. <clears throat> the audio recording that we had over these is actually like on my end corrupted. On Taylor's end it sounds just fine. But on my end, it sounds like we're going... I, I have no idea what happened. Yeah, I RTX uh, decided to go absolutely wild with my voice and was just like, Whoa, check out my filters! We got filters on this shit. We got filters and another. <laughs> yeah, so that was fun. Ah. <sighs> What happened to your gameplay? Oh, okay, now I see what happened. Yeah, the gameplay is fine. Went... Oh yeah, because it went black for half a second. Yeah, I was just, I was worried. I mean, I would be too. <laughs> what happened in this one? I, I don't remember what we did here. Well, we went into the wild area and we caught a bunch of Pokemon. Oh, really? Whoa. Actually, actually yeah, that is what happened. And then you try to get the the Pikachu or the oh. Like, oh, that's right. This is the one that doesn't have either of those. Which I could easily get both of them. But, uh... You should get Eevee. Because I got Pikachu. Ooh, that's big brain. Alright. Uh, in... <laughs> Once we get to... What is it? This is four, right? Uh, right now we're doing four. Yeah, so one... So four, five, six, and seven have that same problem. So once we get those fix, I'll definitely have some gameplay of Let's Go Eevee on there, so I can go back and play it. Okay. I was tempted to wait and just play Let's Go Eevee on stream, and then use that save data. I mean, you could. Yeah, but the next time I'm gonna do that is... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know when. But it is easy shinies. It is In fact, easy I should go shinies, play. you're right. But... I should go play that, because I have the shiny charm. You know what else is easy shinies? What's that? My Nintendo Switch Up Enhancer device that I can plug in through my but, USB. <laughs> but this is even easier, <laughs> and you're what? actually playing. It only takes me a full day. <laughs> or, you know, ten minutes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Dude, I stopped using mine for a bit. Some of the shinies that I've gotten, like, my, my luck is weird. Because it's either I get something really quickly... Like, it very, very, very rarely do uh, do I ever have the kind of luck where it takes forever to get. Two of my, two of the Pokemon of two full boxes worth of Shinies took yeah. me about 900 resets. Oh my god. The rest of them took me, like, 97, uh, 32. Jeez. One of them was 27. And then the, another one that I had was I got a Shiny after about 220 resets, or 220 eggs. And then I hatched another egg, and I hatched another one, and that second one was another shiny. What Pokemon was that? Sinisee. Which yeah, one? My uh, luck was insane. Oh, Sinisee. Nice. Yeah. Did you oh. get an authentic Sinisee? But you can't hatch an authentic Sinisee. I wish. Well, you gotta go. You gotta go to the forest, and you gotta go catch them. Also, oh, this is my favorite part. I love Going this part. and finding a shiny Sinisee in the wild that's authentic. Yeah, oh, good that luck boy. with that, buddy. That's like finding a shiny combi in Diamond and Pearl. <laughs> Sorry, exactly. shiny female combi. She go do that. Go that's find disgusting. the shiny female shiny. Yeah, go do that. That's disgusting. That's some good content. <laughs> yeah, I bet it is. 
Oh, this is where we got uh, Falcon and Gear Pokemon. I forgot which one you named it. Silver Surfer? Is that what it was? Uh, yeah. Oh, that's right. We yeah, got you got the right. Alolan Raichu. Oh, yeah, that's right. Because we have that Alolan Raichu event going on. I'm like, ooh, let's do a video. Like, oh, Alolan Raichu. Look at that. I think we He's just like, did a purple. So now that we did the purple dens, uh, how does that work? Do we just not catch any more in that area? Yeah, once you've done... And it doesn't matter if you do a den or catch one in the wild. Once you've caught a Pokemon in that area and it's registered uh, in the summary as being caught in said area, then you cannot do it again. Now, the okay. problem with catching them through raids online is it doesn't say what raid den it came from, so it'll just say um, caught from a raid den. So technically oh, we could do one of those... We should be allowed to do at least one, depending on what pops up, but... The problem is, this game... Do you remember my problem from before? Oh yeah, you didn't have online, did you? Uh-uh. I could oh, add well. it to the family plan temporarily while we're doing the gameplay, since I don't have a seventh member. Or an eighth member, sorry. I mean, if you don't want to do that, it's fine. <laughs> if I can I've been playing most of this game deals. offline anyway. <laughs> oh, that's right, this is where you caught, uh... This is where you caught your Natu. Yeah, I named it Falcon. No, he's a sweet little Falcon. <laughs> God, I wish it was a shiny one, though. I think that'd be closer to his uh, coloring. What does <laughs> yeah. a shiny Natu look like, anyway? Ooh, shiny Natu. Uh, I believe he's a light green BB. What? It's just light green? No, it, it's Rip? more than just that. I, I have one in Pogo. Hold on. It's, uh... I'll go to Serebii. <clears throat> I got it. Okay, yeah, it's just so light green! Shiny Natu is a light green body instead of a dark green body with, uh... The red on his body is all replaced with orange. Yeah. Oh, that actually looks really good. So the wings are fully orange instead of being orange and red. The feet and the, um, little the penis-looking thing coming off his head are <laughs> both orange as well. <laughs> he actually looks more like a green olive than my olive from my last playthrough did. That's disturbing. That's not what Falcon looks like. We should do one where there's custom shinies. Yo. You can make custom shinies. Oh. We gotta do that. Dude, I'd be down for that. And then, like, uh, Crystal Player or this one, after you hack the switches. I think that'd be oh, sick. Oh, yeah. Gotta give me another Switch, though. Don't worry. Once the Switch Pro is announced, I'll be buying that, and then I'll homebrew my old Switch. I yeah, mean, I'm gonna feel like a fucking um, idiot, too. I, I mean... <laughs> no, you know what? I'm not even embarrassed to say that. What I'll be doing with it is I'll be homebrewing it so that I can make saves of my games. Well, yeah, you want to back up those saves, because yep. we don't know how good Nintendo's going to do that. See, like, I'm still going to have Switch Online regardless. But my one problem with the, uh, my one problem with Nintendo games, with Nintendo systems in the past, is there have been times in which my 3DS has fallen, and there was one time, <laughs> I forgot how much damage that does. <laughs> Did you see that? Oh, yeah, with the Rock Natu. Slide just instantly crushed Natu. That's why I invited those people. I was like, hey man, <laughs> get in here and help me beat it. He's like, mm, rock slide. And then just the the whole Easy. freaking cavern floor just collapses, or the cavern roof just <laughs> collapses on him and crushes the poor Olive. He's like, oh god! Oh! Throw <laughs> there's the Pokemon to catch it. It's like, I caught an Olive! You send it out later. It's gonna be that. it's gonna be a flattened one where it's just like a pancake. <laughs> Go not to! <laughs> It's literally just a frisbee disc. <laughs> <laughs> His bones are going to be broken. It's like, it's okay, you got this, buddy. Use Roost. You got this, my dude. Heal up I'll just your take health. you to the Pokemon Center. No, he's just using Roost all the time. <laughs> he's a pure psychic type now. He uses his psychic abilities to move his crushed body around. God, that would be disturbing. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, as it moves, you see her... It'll move around like ditto. <laughs> Welcome to our family-friendly gameplay here on uh, Pixel Entertainment. <laughs> yeah, family-friendly. Let's go with that. That'll get us through the, the uh, YouTube server. 
<clears throat> oh, yeah. And, Even though... Oh, what? Oh, I was going to say for everyone at home that's uh, watching this. Um, <clears throat> like I said before, I didn't have Switch Online. Because he had Switch Online connected to his uh, profile, he was able to invite some randos in. They all have, like, super powerful Pokemon, which means he's going to be able to beat it quick. On my end, I do not have Switch Online connected to the account yet. So I'm having to do this with the basic uh, heat more wishy-washy... I'm surprised Magikarp isn't in here, too. Uh, oh, yeah, Delmize, that's right. Uh, At least Delmize and... can actually fight. Yeah, well, I mean, surprisingly enough, Solrock's Rock Slide actually does do some decent damage. The problem is he constantly uses solar power, so... Or, is that what it's called? Uh, cosmic power, that's cosmic all he power. uses. Yeah, he, he's trying to use his cosmic brain, and we just, as simpletons, cannot understand what his true intentions are. His true intentions are throwing like hot. Don't, don't, <clears throat> don't bring, no, don't bring that back up. Well, fuck hop. I'm gonna say that on record. <laughs> That's my, uh, if my we presidential were playing the game campaign. Right now, if we were playing the game right now and you said that, then you'd be yeah. screwed. Because it'd get all the way to the end of the game. Alright, so guys, here's what happened on my Nuzlocke when I played through. Well, we're not uh, playing right now, so I'm gonna say it. Fuck up. I was playing Sword Version. I constantly beat Hop. I'm like, God, Hop, you're so trash! And I got all the way to the end of the game. <laughs> and I was getting I was getting ready to have to team up with him to fight. Um, spoiler alert! Skip to a couple of seconds in the future if you don't want to hear it. Three, oh. two, one. Swordward and Shieldbert. <laughs> Damn. The I two know, greatest right? villains of our time. <laughs> Freaking... Squidward and Shield Boy. Uh, Rising and Shield Hero. There we go. Um, <laughs> yeah, uh, me and Hop were going into... Names. What? I can't believe that that's actually their names. It's like... it's, it's beautiful. <clears throat> it's perfect. That's exactly what we need in my Pokemon game. <laughs> All I want is a little bit of Swordward and Shield. <laughs> and their hairstyles are even worse. Anyways, uh, like we it. go in because I'm like, oh, we can easily beat them. I'll have my vanilla because it won't be any issue at all. We go in and um, <clears throat> Hop throws a match. He goes in and he constantly uses Tail Whip. At, he knows that I'm using or whatever it was, like Cotton Guard and then whatever defense, like defense and defense lowering moves he can use. But he doesn't do any actual like helpful damage. He uses... Uh, <clears throat> He uses takedown a couple of times, but then so I go back through anything. after after he, uh, my our whole like team has been crushed. I go back through, uh, at, like this is literally after we lost lost a Nuzlocke. I was like, you know what? I'll just take in my best mons and just play for fun from now. Uh, and I go into it, and guess what happens? He uses double kick <laughs> on Lifeheart. I'm like. McFucking I got to watch the whole thing he went live. Thirteen rounds with your double in there, and he didn't. Ha and he had double double kick and didn't use it once. I lost he didn't my entire use it team. A single time. I lost my entire team because Hop decided to be a little bitch. I was like, I'm yeah. like you know what? Fine. Next does like I play. I won't talk crap about you. Okay. Next does like I play. I don't talk crap about him. His teams have actually been decently challenging. Like, I've actually had a little bit of trouble, because I'm playing Grasslock right now on the channel. You're uh, actually having trouble with him? Not, not really. He was just, it's not that I was having trouble with him, it's just that he was a little bit better than the other one. So, we're calling him, we're calling the Grasslock Hop, uh, the uh, the AU Hop, the Alphate Universe one, where he isn't a total, uh, where he's not a little bitch. <laughs> where he's just not a dick. Yeah, he's he's more like uh, how he's like you know yeah he's just like you're pretty cool like oh, I don't want to be too bad do you we're good friends and then the and the main timeline he's just like I'll fucking beat you up you little shit make you lose it because you made me lose to my brother <laughs> <laughs> you made me lose the you made me lose the championships so now I'm gonna make you lose your nuzlocke <laughs> make me lose the championships now you're gonna lose your Nico Nico kneecaps. <laughs> Oh no! Oh yes, <laughs> not the kneecaps. Nico, Nico, no, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh ball guy. 
Ball Guy is like 10 out of 10 dad material right there. He's the best character in the game. That's why this yeah. game is so good. He is Galaxy Galaxy Ball. Not Galaxy Brain, Galaxy Ball. Which, yeah, that doesn't sound good, but you know what I mean? It doesn't sound much better, but we'll take it. Galaxy Brain. <laughs> Actually, there should be a Galaxy Ball in the game. There Replace should... the uh, Master Ball with that. It's called Beast Ball. Oh. Yep. Damn. Yep. Galaxy Brain, I know. <laughs> well, still, replace the Master Ball with a Galaxy Ball. It'll look much cooler. Yeah, and Galaxy Ball will actually have a 100% chance of catching him. The Master Ball... It's the whole fucking galaxy. Did you know that there are actually people that have missed with their Master Ball? Their Master Ball hasn't yeah. got them? Yeah. It's crazy to think about that, because, like, the chances of it happening are... The chances of catching a Pokemon with it are 99.99999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999999
that uh, that fans are saying are going to be coming back. We don't have confirmation. Um, mm-hmm. But some of the ones that are supposed to be coming back are the Nidoran lines, the uh, Zubat line, the Dratini line, the babies such as Smoochum, Elekid, and Magby. Uh, no, there's no way this is real. You know why I know this isn't real? Why is that? Because the Gen 3 starters are included in the list. Oh, yeah. Game nope. Freak would never add them back. No. There's no way they're going to do that. They're going to say, look, you only have Gen 1, Gen 7, and Gen 8. Those are the only good generations, and yeah. you're going to take it or leave it. What? What? Did you say, uh, uh, Kanto? <laughs> no, we <laughs> want Diamond and Pearl. Kanto! <laughs> I'm hearing Kanto! Kanto. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, what was that? Kanto needs more representation! <laughs> uh... No, the fuck it doesn't. Yo, I want to play Let's Go Johto. <laughs> Actually, I was excited for that, and then it ended up being Pokemon Unite, <laughs> and <clears throat> my day was ruined. Fair. My disappointment is immeasurable, <laughs> and my day is now ruined. I mean, not gonna lie, I am excited for it. I do, I am excited to try it. They shouldn't have woken us up at 7 a.m., though. No, they there's no have. goddamn reason for that. They should have they should have swapped that in Pokemon Snap. People would have been fine with Pokemon Snap. Yeah, yeah, that would have been perfect. Yeah, if they had if they had done that, no one would have been upset. If anything, people would have been even more excited. Yep, but the don't fucked up. God, yeah, let's get people up at seven a.m. to look at a League of Legends clone with Pokemon. Exclusively God. that too. They didn't have any other anything else in that presentation. We still haven't gotten news on Pokemon Sleep. I want to go the fuck to sleep. Yeah, me too. We know about Smile. We know about Home. Or Home has been released uh, now. Wait, Smile hasn't been released yet. I thought it was. People were speed running it already. What? What? Yeah, yeah. There's people speed running Smile. Pretty sure that released already. Was it? Oh. When did it it was just out? like a, a random release, as well as Pokemon Cafe. <gasps> I gotta get down my my uh, 3D or er, on my my um my phone. What Pokemon Smile? Yeah, stalling it right now. I gotta oh, have no. a Bulbasaur sitting on my head while I do this. <laughs> You gotta speed run it too. Oh, absolutely! <laughs> what the hell do Make you sure speed run Pokemon Smile? I I don't know. People have done it. I don't know <laughs> what glitches there are in the game, or like what you could do to get ahead of them, or what. I, I'm so confused. <laughs> people speed run everything, dude. Yo, this little My favorite kid's got one a is the uh... chilling on his head, and that squirrel's like squirt. Who does? Wait, I'm so confused. Are these supposed to be like shadow Pokemon? <laughs> Are I, you brushing shadow Pokemon out of your teeth? I guess. I don't know. <clears throat> Watch out. I, d- I don't understand the lore. It's the uh, Plakamon. Of course. They created an entirely new species of Pokemon. <laughs> well, it's not a new species. It's a new... Um... <clears throat> What's it called? It's a new uh, gimmick. <laughs> of course. They live in your teeth. <clears throat> ah, yes. Indeed. It's disturbing, actually. That's really fucking disturbing. Yep. Anything to do with teeth. By Is the, way... the legendary going to be the tooth fairy? <clears throat> oh, no. <laughs> God, I fucking hope it is. <clears throat> this, this new generation is looking sick. Yo, that'd be pretty kick though. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> All right. <laughs> So listen to this. <clears throat> they refuse to make a new Pokemon TCG online game. What is that? Like, I'm sorry, a new Pokemon TCG game for any of the newer systems because they have TCG online. There's there's no reason to. Is that really what they said? Basically, yeah. They're like, enough, <laughs> enough people play TCG online. We don't need to. I'm like, guys, if you re-release the OG and then they release the like gold and silver one, everyone would be all over that. People would be would actually go out to buy cards again. Other than us. <laughs> I mean, I go out to buy cards, but I don't play the game. 
fair. You should try it sometime. It's really fun. Well, anyway, just, just like collecting the cards. But uh, wait, that's fair. That's fair. Uh, oh, uh, that's, that's, that's what we left to say. Made uh, my so number. So. <clears throat> All right, guys. We will see you in the next episode. Uh, and in uh, the next episode, the end I'll show off my my number that I chose. Ooh. Well, you gotta hide it though.